Yo, the name is Slack. Thanks for coming back. Let's walk with some more Elden Ring Samurai. Today's video is a plunder and pillage excursion into Ainsel River, where a wealth of smithing stones three can be found. The Ainsel River is just crawling with giant ants and claiming both resistance to slash damage, but weak to fire. But you need to know any of that because the golden rule is stick with the Slack and you won't get whacked. All right, enough of the small talk. Let's get busy. Roll the intro. Major. Slack videos. Okay, let's get set up for Ainsel River. Starting with chests, let's store all the pots except for volcano pots. Volcano pots rock. I gotta show you, they just totally rock. They're nuts. So let's just store all these sleep pots. They only keep keep everything for the volcano pots. Next, Ashes of War. First, Weaponry. Like I said, both Giant Ants are resistant to slash damage. Giant Ants and Clayman, they're both resistant to slash damage, so um, the Bloodhound's Fang is not going to be really that much good. What we're going to use is the Large Club. There it is, Large Club plus 30, and our Hornbow is going to be incredibly useful. Hornbow plus 16. And some fire arrows. You got a big batch of fire arrows, and both these enemies have grabbing attacks. So your shield is not going to be that much good, but it will help out sometimes. And you want something with good magic damage protection. Okay, so that would be the Carrion Knight's shield. Right, and of course, your uh, Banished Knight Helm armor set. And um, let's take these three out. This one's going to be variable. You want. Um, your arrows, talismans in slot number two and slot number three. And this one's going to vary according to what's going on. Let's start out with the Blessed Dew talisman. Flask, we can go three health, nine FP. Just like that. On the Large club, let's put Flaming Strike. As throwables, we want, uh, we can get rid of this, we'll use this manually. I want, um, this is just as a backup thing, just to kind of like do in enemies that are almost dead. Let's use um, Crystal Darts, because they're nice and fast. Volcano pots here. Here, what do I want? Oh, yeah, rainbow stone. And let's make a big batch of rainbow stones. And the star of the show, volcano pots. Oh, I visited the, uh, after I stashed the, uh, the pots. That should have been the last thing I did. My bad. Okay, having stashed those, let's make a big batch of volcano pots right away. Okay, so we got 10 volcano pots ready to go. Crystal darts, rainbow stones, That's it. We're ready to rock. Starting out with the hornbow. All right. Ainsel River Depths. If you've been following this walker, you have this location already mapped out. Let's get up. Let's get into it. Let's get involved. Okay, we have a whole bunch of giant ants over here. Should be able to one-shot them. We'll shoot now and loot later. Yeah, who's your daddy? And this guy defies being locked onto, so just 
aim manually and do him in. Alright. If any ants get up in your face, flaming strike. Actually, I just want to experiment with something. Um, what are you doing? Slack changing this strategy on the fly? No, don't do that. Don't do that. <laughs> I just love doing that. Uh, what did I do? I didn't mean to do that. Let's use the... The lantern? Oh, yeah. And why not? Let's throw the uh, the torch... Even though we got the lantern on for some extra light. There we go. Very useful. This is a dead end. I just want to go down here and get some loot. Some magic grease. Alright. Okay, looking all around. These ants are really sneaky. There's one right there. Where are you going? What? What? Dang it. Made me waste an arrow. And there's one around the corner here. Let's just free throw a volcano pot in there. Get him to come out. <laughs> and they got this acid spray that can't be blocked. It goes right through your shield. It does physical damage. This is a sucker play. He's down. I have a feeling we're gonna get sandwiched in here. Go down a little bit, just a little bit, and turn back. Watch your back. There he is. I knew it. <laughs> Got to get up pretty early in the morning to put one over on this laxer. There's going to be another one behind us. There he is. Did slack call it or did slack call it? Stick with the slack and you won't get whacked, except if you're a giant ant. Yeah! Bitch! Alright. Give me that smithing stone three. And this should be a dead end. Alright, very good. Alright, we're going this way down to the southwest. Easy, easy. There we go, I knew it. Okay, he's really on my ass. Let's get a move on. Let's make a call for this flaming strike. And turn around and whack him. And if we get some distance, then he's gonna do the acid. Now I gotcha. Be careful with that acid spray, it can really chew up your health. Uh oh. Oh, watch now. Stay frosty slack.
looks good. Okay, we can. Oh, here we got some activity over here. This guy we could just sneak up on. Although I've never been able to do a backstab on an ant, but uh, we sneak up on him. Load up a charge attack and whammo frisbee. This looks like a dead end, but you can actually go this way. So there's basically two ways you can go. Down this way or up that way. This is the better choice to the south. They get you to an upper level. And let's top off the volcano pots. Okay. This is like. Yeah, this is the queen ant hive. Alright, lots of ants in here. Let's just free aim and pick off all these guys right from this point here. Yeah, go Clint Eastwood on your ass. Picking them off here, boss. And the ant, the queen ant, is gonna give up a rune arc. Give me that rune arc. And the golden rune. Thank you very much. And that's everybody. We got the uh, enemy group refill. So this area, area should be clear. Okay, um, I have a funny feeling I missed something. Let me just run back. I'll just like speed this up and post. No, it looks like we got everything. Okay, we're good. Oh, palace runes. Ruins. And we got the high ground. Make sure you jump down to this ledge here. Get the celestial dude. And then the best thing you could do is just hang out at this end of the ledge here and wait for all these claymen to congregate. This is an absolute riot. Using volcano pots. Just wait right here. They're all gonna like, you know, he's over there. We're over there. If we all congregate below him, we can kill him. How? I don't know. We'll figure that out later. But for now, let's everybody go down here and group together. And we got one guy who's got glowing eyes. That means he's going to give extra extra money. Attaboy. They're grouped nicely together now. Because you know you want to get a piece of me, right? Here we go. Yeah. Beautiful. Come on now, you know you wanna. Right here. There we go. Okay, let's have some fun. Volcano pot your ass. Welcome to my barbecue. <laughs> Is that a riot or what? <laughs> Easiest way to kill these guys. Easiest way to kill a big batch of claimant. By far. And if they're like almost dead.
if they're almost dead like that guy, you can just throw a crystal dart at him or two. Don't waste a volcano pot. Check this guy out. He's like, I think I can just roll up the cliff there. There we go. I love the way that volcano pot works. It just like makes them like spaz out. Okay, these guys have gotten the defilade on me. Are you almost dead? Yeah, you're with the pot. <laughs> and you're the big money guy, eh? And a crystal dart to finish you off. Another one. Yep. That should be it. Too much fun. Well, ain't broke. Don't fix it. Who do we got to load it up as a... Uh, Banished Knight Engvall. Grab all these formic rock we'd use those to make some acid spray, that same attack that the ants use. We can actually buy the cookbook for that fairly shortly. Um, let's get Spanky up there. Alright, Spanky, time to shine. Go get this guy. Yeah, there we go. It's all you, man. It's all you. You got this. I'm gonna watch my back. Okay, while well, Spanky's working on those guys, hang on, I don't want to watch the show here. <laughs> you go! That's right, Spanky. It's your birthday. It's your birthday. Go, Spanky. Go, Spanky. Okay, we got the enemy group refill for that. They're all dead. Okay, let me just uh, make the tour here. There's some little bit of chump loot to pick up here. Smithing stone one. Gold over in three. A big group of claymen in the center there. And we can call down the elevator. Take that up afterwards um, to discover a site of grace. I'm not sure if Spanky's going to survive out there, so we'll do that later. All right, so next, these guys are just begging for some volcano pots. Oh, it's a holocaust. What? Watch it now. I dare you. Ah, uh, hello. <laughs> and Spanky disappeared. That means that uh, all the enemies are gone. Alright, let's go looting. Those volcano pots rock or what? I had no idea they were so powerful and so much fun. They're nuts. Best crowd buster ever. Um, now, for what's coming up next, once again, we have two choices. We can go through the hallway here. Actually, I think there's um, 
some loot down this way. Let me just check. But this is not the best choice. Because we're going to have to deal with that big bad boy up there who is best handled by going another path. But first let me discover this side of grace up the elevator. Okay, I was just making sure there's no loot back there. Okay, just discover, do not rest, because everything's obviously is gonna respawn. And that would be the Ainsel River Sluice Gate side of grace. See some loot down here. Oh yeah, the Shatter Shard Arrows, and Smithing Stone 3, excellent. I'll show you on the map where we, were, where we are, but um, we don't have the map yet. We're going to get it shortly. Okay, like I said, you could go that way, but no. Just no. <laughs> he's want to come back here later on. Maybe you want to lay out a few rainbow stones so you could easily find this path here. It's kind of a hidden path. Let's throw on the Dragon Crest Shield Talisman, and you still want these two Arrows Talismans on. And we're going to make a little speed run up here. We got to deal with that big bad boy up there. The best way to deal with him is to go straight up this ramp here, using my club as a pointer, straight up the ramp. We're going to take cover behind this pillar here, he's going to rain a whole bunch of like this holy hell rain of rocks down on you. Once that's passed, um, we're going to take advantage of being up there and race across here, grab this smithing stone here, probably take some heat on the way back, but we can survive, and then run up the path on the right side, and I'm going to show you a place where we can take cover and get a perfect defilade on this guy, and then we'll just do him in with a hornbow. All right, that's the plan. Let's do it. Stop here. Okay, let's go for the smithing stone. Watch it now. Yeah, watch it. Yeah, like I said, take some heat, but you can you can handle it. 
and up here and just before this spot here see where that it's kind of like steps here you got a perfect defilade on this guy so let's switch back to um, the blessed do talisman so we're recovering health while we're doing this and the bow and precision aim and just shoot he can't touch you there you go that's right it's MC Hammer time. Can't trust this. Can't trust this. Like I'm moving the group. Can't trust this. Can't trust this. And let's take a gold pickled foul foot because he actually coughs up a pretty penny. And finish him off. It. Who loves you? Slack loves us, that's right, and don't you forget it. Alright, so that's that. Easiest way to take him down. Okay, I wouldn't drop down there because you only be able to come back up and you have to go all the way around again. Um, Put on my uh, telescope here. Okay, so that ledge up there is inaccessible except if we remain up here. If we go down, we won't be able to get there again, and that we got to work that area first. So let's just double back this way. Watch it now. Wow, wow, wow. Alright. Fresh batch of volcano pots. See if it's a safe drop down. Indeed, it is. Do we have any soft cotton? Yes, we do. This will make us drop quietly. <laughs> Sir Diabolical after two hand, and we get the backstabbing. Smile in your face all the time. I want to take your place. The backstabber. These guys are like when you got them like by themselves, you can like easily circle around them. I call this a circle jerk. I'm right around them. <laughs> I get a backstab on them. Yeah, circle jerk. That's got to be embarrassing, eh, Mr. Clayman? You got me dead to rights, and I just like dance around you and do a backstabbing. Alright, we got a couple here. And the other one got away too fast. Oh, you're doing the, uh, no, no, no. You can actually kick them out of that, that magic attack that they do with crystal darts. Or any other kind of dart. Let's just finish you off. You're bothering me. There we go, okay. And can we back, get a backstabbing on you? We'll watch it now. <laughs> Circle jerk! <laughs> I love doing that. Who's left? Here's somebody swinging away there. Did you give up a Clayman's harpoon? No. It's you. Okay. You can actually, you know, withstand those if you got your carrying knight shield up. See, they can kick them out of that. Try it again. Come on, I dare you. Go ahead, try to throw that, that crap at me. Come on. What, are you scared? 
Let's see if you can knock him off. He's like, okay, fine. Enough out of you. Yeah. Okay, so I believe that's the upper level clear. Except for this. Smithing stone one times three. All right, let's do an inventory on the smithing stones. Six threes, great. Should be some more down there. Okay, let's let me make sure that I've got all the loot up here before we drop down, because it's kind of like the point of no return. Well, I mean, like, not completely the point of no return, but kind of like, you know, pain in the ass to come back kind of thing. Okay, I think we're good. Oh yeah? You got those bull assist things happening, eh? Interesting. Alright, give me your best shot. Why did you go down there? You were nicely grouped with together with that other guy. Alright, here we go. Welcome to my barbecue. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, right. That's right. Get together. Group nicely together. Here we go. Beautiful together. The guy rolled in. Nice. And again. Is that nuts or what? I love you, Volcano Pot. I love you too, Slack. Yeah. You're my new best buddy. Alright. Let's drop on down. I think I'm gonna kill it, shoot now and loot later because, um. What typically happens in here is I get so busy dealing with these guys that I loot some stuff and I miss other stuff. You are getting a crystal dart to finish you off. These guys are nicely grouped together, so you get the welcome to my barbecue kind of routine. <laughs> and again. I like the way they turn around and go, what's going on over there? Are you making hot dogs? How come you didn't invite me? What the hell? And not a good way to deal with these guys is to simply do a jumping attack. A couple of jumping attacks and they're done. Oh, here come the authorities. Let's get the high ground on these guys. Make some more barbecue pots. Ooh, Formic Rock. Oh, nice. I'm just begging for it. Just begging for it. Alright, here we go. Welcome to my barbecue. How do you like your ribs? Shooting fish in a barrel here, boss. Stop with that. See you. It's got a big bang, but as long as you got your shield up, carrying your night shield. Um, you're all by your lonesome, aren't you? Wait a minute, I hear another one down there. Yeah, get nicely grouped together here. All 
Mary though, so we just got one left. All right. There we go. You've done your David and Goliath thing? Okay. Time to die. Alright, you're gonna get a circle jerk. <laughs> Swing and a miss. <laughs> Gotta love it. <laughs> Clayman's harpoon! Thank you very much. I think I already have one actually. Well, anyways, I'll look at that later. Circle jerk. What? Watch it now. There you go. And I should have the assassin's crimson dagger hooked up. In a circle jerk? Watch it out. Watch it. Hey, what? No. Where'd he go? Oh! Another Clayman's harpoon. Where'd the other guy go? Must be at least one alive. I didn't get an enemy group refill. I hear some activity. There he is. behind him. There we go. And give me some health back. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. I think our work here is done. Okay, let's go looting. This is basically some chump loot. There's a set of grace up here. Obviously, just discover it. Don't rest because you're going to respawn everybody. Okay? So that's discovered just in case you screw up. You can just restart there. Let's go back and pillage these mofos. Oh, we got one left. Couple left. Watch your back. Hmm. That's what I'm talking about. Watch now. Where did he go? Oh. Watch now. Whoa, whoa, wait. What? Oh, wait a minute. There we go. Yeah. Came right up your rear and didn't even have the decency to give you a reach around. <laughs> bad slack, yeah, bad slack. Getting lewd with the claimant. Ghost Glover 2. A bunch of Silver Firefly. 
anything hid behind the waterfall? No, there is not. Oh, we got a batch up here. Okay. They are definitely a candidate for the volcano pot. Saw a whole bunch of guys sleeping here. Here. Damn. You guys know the routine. When you snooze, you lose. We looted down there. sparkly thing over there. What's your story? Smithing Stone 3. That's the one I was looking for. The big money one. Yeah. I should have got the map first. Well, anyways. You just use the, uh, the geography. Or rather these, uh, it's right behind this thing here. Okay. That's what I'm talking about. Nine smithing stones, three. Yeah, that's what the way. That's where we should be at this point. Okay, let's go visit the merchant. And this is the map. Okay, so those three smithing stones, three are right at this location in the map. Okay. This guy doesn't really have much for sale except the uh, the cookbook to make acid spray mist, is which I think is worth it. Well. He's also got the prisoner's gear complete. Debating whether to buy this. Um, yeah, this guy's really out of the way. I'm gonna buy that one. That's one that makes acid spray mist. Yeah, let's buy this too. And Lost Ashes of War. These are rare. Um, yeah, I'm gonna buy that too. That's it. All right, so that's this part of Angel River done. Ul Palace Runes, Ul Palace Runes, Ul Palace. You know, I'm gonna go with Ul Palace Runes. And the Sight of Grace is right there. I'm not gonna rest long. I'm just gonna make one final tour off camera to make sure I didn't miss any loot. So you can rest here, and I'm gonna sign off. Hey, nice long video for you guys. 
my name is Benji. But <laughs> what's your name, Slack? <laughs> Hang on, let me think about this. Yeah, my name is Major Slack, and I definitely approve this video. If you do too, please give the old Slackster a big old thumbs up, post a comment, and most importantly, subscribe to make sure you get all my videos hot off the press. All right, see you next time.